Well, hello and welcome along to everyone who's uh, joining us for our live broadcast today. We are full steam ahead for this from the gantry, but we have to report to you first up that the match itself, whilst not jeopardised by the weather, certainly may have its dynamic affected by this torrential sterile rain which is uh, upon us and which has appeared almost from nowhere in the uh, hour or so up to kick-off. It could prove a considerable test for the officials and certainly for the players. We do have our fingers crossed that it won't affect the uh, game itself. I'll tell you what, this could be a big difference. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game in stages. Two high-profile, high-caliber teams. This is a welcome event for all these supporters. Well, get ready for some high-grade football, Peter. Two strong teams, as you say, full of wonderful individual talent. And we have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football. As to whether we'll see high-scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining, though, because there are good players everywhere you look around this surface, and that's a fine start in itself. And if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Who do you, Jim, see making the difference here? Yeah, Bernd Leno. I think his presence might make all the difference for this team. He's got lightning-fast reactions and uh, a coolness under pressure that allows him to make the big one-on-one -on -one saves. He's also very reliable under the high ball or when he's dealing with crosses, and I'd expect the whole defence to play with a bit more assurance with him in place. Yes, yeah, getting the... Up for the header! Good delivery, but no joy. Well, being able to generate that amount of activity in the box means it's hard not to pick someone out. Ferran Torres. And it's William. Ake cuts it out. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. And Ketia. Now a chance to break. And it's been taken straight back. And it's Mondi. Going through. Mendy. Great leap! Oh, a header, but again the same outcome. How hard can it be to time the jump with the right contact? It's not that difficult, is it? Ceballos plays it forward. Yeah, that's top defending in preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Foden. Mares. They try as they might, they just couldn't get into an attacking area. And it's Aubameyang. And here's William. De Bruyne tries to get it forward quickly. He's got away. Ferran Torres. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. Nketiah. William! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Arsenal have found chances hard to come by, so that's perfectly understandable.
Hector Bellerin. And it's William. Unketia. Unketia spreads it towards the left. Laporte, chance to break. Laporte goes looking. Leno sends that a long way. Well, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Peter, we can only applaud that quality of tackle in the circumstances. It was probably goal-saving. Has a goal! The captain delivers! Well, it's so hard to keep someone with his enthusiasm and his energy quiet. Second best will never be accepted in the world he lives in, and the timing of his goal won't be lost on him. It's crucial. Simplicity itself. It's rarely a problem when that much time is afforded in the penalty box. Nobody sensed where the danger was lurking, and the finish was made a lot easier. A 1-0 lead established. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. Now it's Mares. He's off for the Ferran Torres! They finish! A goal at a really telling moment. That really is quite fabulous. All his own doing. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Yeah, it's always a dangerous time when you've just scored. You can easily lose focus and then bang, you're pegged back again. And we hit half-time, but it has been an even contest, as the scoreline suggests, and it has been more than decent to watch. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Yeah, I think they'll be happy with that scoreline. I just hope the second half is as good as the first. It's been pulsating stuff. Well, the scoreline indicates a pretty tight game, but there has been a lot of action in it, and it has been an exceptionally good watch. The score at half-time, 1-1. One, one. We're already back on the way here. Saka. Hector Bellerin. Nenny, forward it goes. Caballos, David Luiz, Saka, Saka drives it forward. William. William with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. <laughs> Laporte. Rodri. William plays a clever pass. It's a loose ball. Hoists it forward. De Bruyne. Ferran Torres. Ferran Torres finds himself offside. (laughs) 
Saka battles to win it back. And here's Mores. And Sterling! Good hit, kept the keeper honest. And it's played forward. And it's Sterling. Mare, he's gone for it! Good stop, that wasn't easy. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Arsenal can make their change now with uh, a break in play. And that's been levered clear. Walker gets it into the middle. Aubameyang, who's made his mark on this game. Walker tries to get it forward quickly. Ferran Torres, he's had a shot! Truly turned on its head. Ferran Torres with the smoothest one on one finish. He is one very cool customer. But well, how's that for composure, Peter? You can see the keeper tried to put as much pressure on him by staying upright, but it didn't phase him, not in the slightest. His second of the game, and an eye now for the hat trick. But there's going to be another change here. So we have a breakthrough. Now how will things develop from here? Yeah, for me, this team seems to find it easier to attack than defend. But now they're going to need to dig in at the back a bit. Sterling. Mares. Good take, and he's hit one! Should have put that one away. Well, he's definitely kept the side in the game then. That's really good positioning. They could have doubled their lead there. Arsenal making consecutive changes here. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. Delivery from Walker. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Good challenge, he just stood firm. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Bit of an appeal, but nothing doing. And it's Lacazette. A buccaneering run from the defender. Look, with time running out, they have to get the ball in the penalty box, and if it means a long punt, then so be it. They've got to give themselves a chance. Luis gets it back. And he's there to hoof it away. Cedric Suarez. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. And that is that.